Hello, everybody! Watch this video to find out how to recover data after resetting a Windows 11 computer to factory defaults and how to reset Windows 11 to factory settings without losing data. Hello, friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you will be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. Sometimes, when your computer is plagued by frequent errors and freezes, you have no other options left but to reset it to factory defaults. Reinstalling or resetting the computer's operating system can fix many different bugs and glitches, but it also means that all computer settings are restored to their default or factory values. What is worse, it can also remove important files and even all your data. Within a few minutes, I'll show you how to reset a Windows 11 computer safely and without risking your precious personal files. And even if worse comes to worst, you'll know how to recover data lost after an unsuccessful attempt at resetting and reinstalling an operating system or formatting a hard disk. Just as any other operating system, Windows 11 may sometimes have issues, especially if you're using a test build, so I'm sure you're interested to see how to fix them quickly. The most general and quick solution to most problems you may encounter while using your operating system is to reset it. This action will restore factory settings, rebuild damaged system files, and bring your computer back to normal. This is how it's done. Click on the Start menu and open Settings, or press the key shortcut Windows I. Open the Update and Security category. In the left panel, select Recovery and then look to the right to find Reset this PC, Restart PC. To save your file from removal, choose the option Keep my files. But if you want a brand new start, hit Remove everything. Now choose how the system should be reset, select Local Reinstall and click Next. You will see a warning saying your computer is ready for resetting and explaining the consequences of doing that. Click Reset to confirm your decision. The resetting process will begin. The computer will restart several times, so just wait a little until everything is over. If you face a problem with damaged system files, a blue screen of death, or the reset process was interrupted and the computer can't boot anymore, use Hetman Partition Recovery, a specialized tool for recovering data. When you choose to reset your computer and keep your files, they are not moved anywhere, and the chances of their being damaged are very little, even if the resetting or installing process was interrupted or halted because of an error. The files are still there, on a hard disk. This is how you can recover them safely. Connect the hard disk containing your files to a properly working Windows computer. Start the program and scan the disk. If your choice when resetting the computer was to keep personal files, you will find all your data on the hard disk, inside the same folders where you used to store them. To have your files back, select the ones you need and click Recovery. Choose where to save them and click Recovery again. When the entire process is over, you will find the recovered files in the folder you have chosen. If you accidentally chose the wrong reset option and all your data was removed, don't give up. Even if the files are gone after resetting the computer, they can still be recovered. Provided you haven't written too much stuff to this hard disk after the reset operation, the files may be still intact. In fact, erasing a file takes much longer than most people tend to believe, and that is why file recovery operations become possible. When you restart Windows during the reset operation, the system says files are removed from the hard disk. 
They are no longer displayed on the disk as the system marks the disk space as good for writing new data, but the deleted files are still available for recovery. You can bring them back with the help of specialized data recovery software. On the other hand, if the old data has been overwritten, you have very little chance to recover it so easily. That's why we recommend beginning data recovery as soon as possible after you are finished with the reset operations. To make sure the file recovery is successful and your data is not going to be erased in the process, you got to choose a reliable tool for the job. Hetman Partition Recovery knows how to recover files after various scenarios such as factory reset, formatting, system errors, virus attacks, and partition issues. With this tool, you'll be able to recover large amounts of data in various formats documents, images, videos, audio files, and archives. In addition to the high rate of successful recovery and speed of operation, this tool is also 100% safe and will never overwrite your data while trying to recover it. The program has a preview feature to make things easier when you want to find and recover specific files. To start recovering your stuff, right-click on the disk and choose Open. Select the scan type. After the fast scan, the program displays the disk contents and deleted files are marked with the red cross. If you're not happy with the fast scan result, run full, full analysis, which is longer but gives you the chance to find all the information remaining on the disk. Select the files you want to recover, click Recovery, select where you want to save them, and click Recover again. We don't recommend saving the data to the same disk you are trying to recover it from, as it can erase the files. If possible, save the information to another disk. When the entire process is over, you will find the recovered files in the folder you have chosen. I'd like to remind you, though, that the best method to prevent data loss is to back up all important information before a system reset or any other action involving the risk of file removal. And that is all for now. Hopefully this video was useful. Remember to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Push the bell button to receive notifications and never miss new videos. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck.